Yeah. 
First of all, we'll work on Muladhara Chakra with Ganesh Mantra and we'll start. Om Tvameva Saksan Shri Ganesha Saksan Shri Arishati Matati Shri Nipada Devi Namo Namaha Shri Sumukha Om Tvameva Saksan Shri Sumukha Namo Namaha Shri Ikadanta Om Tvameva Saksan Shri Ikadanta Namo Namaha Shri Kapila Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Kapila Namo Namaha Shri Gajakarnaka Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Gajakarnaka Namo Namaha Shri Lamboda Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Lamboda Namo Namaha Shri Vikata Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Vikata Namo Namaha Shri Vignanasha Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Vignanasha Namo Namaha Shri Ganadi Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Ganadi Namo Namaha Shri Dumla Ketu Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Dumla Ketu Namo Namaha Shri Ganadi Aksha Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Ganadi Aksha Namo Namaha Shri Bala Chandra Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Bala Chandra Namo Namaha Shri Gajanana Om Dwameva Saksa Shri Gajanana Namo Namaha Saksha Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nimbala Devi Namo Namaha We will work on the left side and Mantra of Sri Bhairava, 21 names of Bhairava for left side. Om Amevi Saksak Shri Bhairava Saksak Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namo Namaha Shri Maha Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Maha Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Vaduka Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Vaduka Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Siddha Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Siddha Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Kankala Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Kankala Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Kala Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Kala Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Kala Gni Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Kala Gni Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Yogini Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Yogini Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Shakti Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Shakti Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Ananda Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Ananda Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Matanda Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Matanda Bhairava Namo Namaha Shri Gaura Bhairava Om Dwameva Saksak Shri Gaura Bhairava Namo Namaha 
ಶ್ರೀ ಬಾಲಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಬಾಲಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಬಾತು ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಬಾತು ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಸ್ಮಶಾನ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಸ್ಮಶಾನ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಪೂರ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಪೂರ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ತರುಣ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ತರುಣ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಸುರಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಸುರಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಜ್ಞಾನಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಜ್ಞಾನಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಉತ್ತಮಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಉತ್ತಮಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀ ಅಮೃತಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ಓಂ ತ್ವಮೇವ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಅಮೃತಾನಂದ ಭೈರವ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಆದಿಶಕ್ತಿ ಮಾತಾಜಿ ಶ್ರೀ ನಿರ್ಮಲಾ ದೇವಿ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ now we are going to work on our wife on on 108 names of shri adi guru dadatare so that will take approximately 11 minutes pure hum adi guru dadatare ke 108 naam bolenge smatra ke kendin karenge aur hamesha hum kendin hamare bhavsagar ki aur kendin karna hai so this will create a double cleansing of our white so remember these are the 108 names of shri adi guru dattatreya 108 naam hai shri adi guru dattatreya ke okay. so let's go on this ಶ್ರೇಯಸ್ಕರ ನಮಃ 
Om 
शत्रु मर्दिनी Om Shin Durga Mata Jagadamba Namaha Om Shri Raksha Kari Namaha Om Rakshasa Gni Namaha Om Shri Chamunda Namaha Om Madho Ketaha Andri Namaha Om Narakantaka Namaha Om Handa Sura Mardini Namaha Om Shri Shirdi Sainat Namaha Om Shri Shiva Shakti Putra Kartike Namaha Om Shri Kartike Namaha Om Sarva Sura Mardini Namaha Om Sarva Bhatha Vinashini Namaha Om Sarva Satya Guru Mardini Namaha Om Sarva Bhaya Hagni Rudra Rupa Namaha Sākshāt Shri Ādi Shakti Mātāji Shri Mimmalā Devyai Namo Namahā Okay, so we end our work and then We will continue with our meditation. Whatever we could do, gently we did it. Now is the time for surrenderance. Okay, sampurna, samarpana. Shumadali, I give my ego and superego to you. You manage my ego and superego. Ma, Mera, Ankar or Pratyankar, Aap Le Dejje. Or Aap Hi Usko Manage.
let's put our attention on our within our heart in sarasthana apna chitta hriday mein aur sarasthana ke This is the prayers which was given by Shri Mataji in 1984. It is a prayer to the Mother. Mother, please come in my heart. let me clean my heart so that you are there put your feet into my heart let your feet be worshiped in my heart let me not be in delusion take me away from illusions keep me in reality take away the shame of superficiality let me enjoy your feet in my heart let me see your feet in my heart shamata ji yaad shakti ma kripya a mere hriday par padare mujhe hriday ko shuddh karne de यहां पर आप विराजी अपने पुनित श्री चरण की पूजा हमसे करा दे माया जाल के तम से हटा के ज्योतिमय हमें बनाए हृदय चरण के मधुर मिलन से चंदन महिमा लुभा श्री चरण के अमृत धार में कृपया हमें नहीं लाए
the next few minutes we are going to meditate with the music just be in the vichar We are going to listen to a unique lecture of Shubhadaji. This was given by Shubhadaji from in 1979, March 14. Where Shubhadaji is talking about early Sahaja Yoga experiences. There are lots of things to be learned here. Video, you can see, you can see the video of Shimadaji with the 
Hindi subtitle and the English subtitles. Extracts mother's comments, early cerebral experiences.
that the whole thing, the energy of the complete sympathetic, whatever they Sympathetic. Because sympathetic is too much activated. Mm -hmm. Then what happens? The sympathetic system has your stored of energy, whatever it is. So it just sucks in all that. And when it is sucked in, suddenly the uh, wave from uh, the pelvic plexus down below starts. Mm -hmm. Because you see, the, all the energies are released uh -huh. to the sympathetic. Because the sympathetic is so exhausted that whatever is the energy left in the chakra is released. Once it is released, you see all that release energy makes you feel that the energy is rising to you because it is rising to Irantila. Now this is the uh, energy which is just sucked into Irantila. It rises up. And it, you can feel it going up by coming down and all that. But the, the after effects of this is what is this? That such a person, of course, in these, uh, uh, these, these experiences, people feel sometimes a, uh, a horrible thing also that they, they feel that uh, there's a heat liberation, and sometimes they feel some sort of a scorpion bites going on, or some snakes coming up, and all kinds of things can happen. It can be very horrifying also. And it could be very simple also. But when this happens, the after effects is like that, that you become unusual. You see, sort of all these uh, uh, drug systems started afterwards that, after that. Because once you are released from that self-control self in between, you can take to anything like this. Because you are free now, mm -hmm. whatever you feel, you see. And that's how you can take to drugs and this. And this is what uh, the, all these gurus are doing, is to take out the stored energy which is controlling you. Suck them out onto the sympathetic. There are so many ways that you they can starve you, they can make you work very hard, they can make you tired, they can uh, they can make you say some mantra things. I mean they make your sympathetic work so hard that ultimately a state is reached where your chakras release all the energy that is in store in us and just get out of it. So all this energy they will suck in and a person feels oh suddenly something like that. But in these circumstances, you see, you can may have a big hollow in the head like that. And it's like a mad person has, see, a big hollow. And the whole thing is sucked in. And you get a hollow there like that. So many people get a thing. That is a very different. But because all that energy that was inside is sucked in. So it has become like a big hollow inside, you see. Like a mad person has to the same thing. So this is, this is the way people confuse between Kundalini awakening and the exhaustion of the same thing. Not only in the Kundalini awakening, through, through Sarah Yoga, you do not feel it. It just goes up and goes up. But sometimes, if there is, after realization, if there is an obstruction, due to certain uh, combinations, which may be the obstruction may go out like that. But there is a tremendous difference between the two. The first, you, you release in the hands of the vibrations. But with the first one, you do not get out of the you get heated up. And you start avoiding yourself, escaping from yourself. And this starts, and that's how you get into these drugs. This is, this is very much played by the, by the gurus. You see, that's what they do to you. They exhaust you completely, so that you cannot stand the reality at the present moment. And so you try to get into something. And once you try to escape it, you see, you just, the whole release of the stores of parasympathetic takes place, and the energies are broken. And you are broken, you become arbitrary. It's a cancer itself, sort of a thing. That's not the way you are but we would say it is more a sympathetic uh, system which comes into play and the movement of parasitic is the same, what you call that? Pumping up, parasitic uh, movements of the pumping up of the energy starts. You just start putting it into the thing. And the whole thing is acting because of the post. So one should not continue with the other because after the arrival, you cannot take the drug easily. It's very really good. You have to really force them to take the drug. One thing is hypertension. If you have a hypertension and you become very agitated, you start dancing, you become hypertension. See, these things can happen. That you can start 
you may start dancing, jumping, shopping, doing all kinds of things, getting to learn, learn teachers, learn from singers, because that's how you are like to the control on your on the being of the wisdom become. And then you just get into it. And you don't see the big picture of uh that called the uh you are the conscious. The picture of the conscious is no more. You just go uh arbitrary, you just uh are in shoot up. It can happen to people even without feelings. Even without feelings is something which can get in that kind of thing. That's how they become alcohol in and they become on these things where they are not okay. Now then it's okay. Eventually he was actually on that bread because he got cirrhosis of flavor. And he was going to die. So he had left Sarah Yoga and he wanted to commit on his own and all that and he just lost it. Poor thing, within three months he started showing business. And he was so bad for all. I brought him home. My husband had gone abroad. And he came back and said, What's this you're going to take a person in the house? They are going to prosecute us. We are all going to be in jail. He's going to die. Next moment, the way he is, I just can't keep it. He was very angry. Yes. Now, when can I send him? See, after all, he's so sick. If you're very in your room, I can send him anywhere now. He said, All right, tomorrow you are ready to start taking and send him away. But next day, he was my husband, he walked from his bed. He saw the gentleman walking about. He was so surprised that I asked, Kevin, this is a fellow, he's out. I'm not in bed, I can't just believe my heart. I can believe it. Seven days, he was completely pure. But then he just told me that, Mother, some of us are so interested in that we have to go to that place to know I to come. It's not possible for some people to give up their ego and to behave in this manner. So we better allow them to go to that position and then come back. I said, For a mother, it's difficult. She will try to tell them again and again that no, no, we try to get all right. So that's what he told me. But this is very true. You see, what I found with the Western people is they're really egoistical in the sense that. Uh, they, they don't like uh, killing themselves. You see, the ego is so self destroyed that they know that it's fine versus, but just to satisfy the ego, they go on to see the story versus. And they reach such a funny point that people can't understand how that is from foolish about it. Then he started respecting himself, and then he went to his mother and said, I think he's coming as love for my mother. He had left for years. He never bothered about it. And he went down now to the hospital and just walked in. Mother, and he is coming back to me and showing me that the top he likes to be better. So, this is what is the thing of this uh, Gus, who was the leader of all the new kings of London, and he was a very clever boy, and he was a physics professor. And uh, so, you can imagine what can happen to a mystical person, how he can be this complete person. So, that's that. <laughs> The first lot that I had in my activity that was, there were about 300 people, out of which were at least 275 people in the weekends. And they all were suffering from some people or other. I got such a kind of I was so angry uh, with all of them. I said, none of you are, are helping to come to me. Some were suffering from paralysis, uh, some were suffering from gout, and all kinds of problems there. And in that lot, I found food which is more kind of thing and it absolutely cool. Very, very cool. So much that he, he was like a uh, frozen, uh, frozen, you can say, a frozen uh, dough, a frozen dough. And I felt him, I said, no, this is too much. But because of his heart catching, when your heart is caught up, you can feel that kind of coolness. Because it impresses your heart, you know, when you get that thing. So I call him Kuli. And uh, Kuli is a uh, one doctor who you might have heard about him, who is in uh, Houston, where they are operating really fortune. I have given my grandchild there. So I met him, he looked very much like our Kuli, but he's a very tall fellow, a very kindly person. And uh, when I saw him, you see I combined his people together because he's so cool and you know, also face so much like Dr. Kuli that I call him Kuli. And uh, that's all. And then whenever he talked to me, he said, I you remember mother after two weeks to me. So his name became Kuli forever. <laughs> <laughs> now come on. Uh, 
Ating Shabang Sastra at Akar. Let us now listen to Shiva Ham Shiva. Thank you. 
Shri Mataji, Lali Shakti Ma. Thank you very much for clearing us and for giving us this meditation. For Shri Mataji, please forgive us, forgive me for all my mistakes. Bless us that we all have good health. And please keep us always on self track. Shri please protect me and protect us collectively from all types of negative attacks. Thank you very much. And thanks to all the Sahaja Yogis. Jai Shumataji. See you again.